What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. It's Doyle here from Premier RV out here in Bluegrass, Iowa. Today we're going over the all new 2025 Keystone Bullet 310 RES. This is the top bullet line. They've got three classic crossfire and the bullet. And this one looks incredible. Huge upgrade from previous years. They really outdid themselves this year. Looks incredible. It's got the barreled roof with strip lighting on the inside. It looks amazing. We're going to get into it. But make sure you like this video and leave a comment. Let me know what you think of this one. And make sure you subscribe so you don't miss any future videos. Now let's get right into this one. Stepping into this one, you really do just get a wow factor when you walk in. It's got the barrel roof on the ceiling with this strip lighting, which looks incredible. And to me, it feels like it's a lot easier on the eyes. You get this wood trim up here, which is real wood. And it looks incredible. You got that bullet logo here, the flying bee, they call it. And all the windows are framed out, which look incredible. The other great thing is they all have these kind of wood shelves right here you can set your phone on. And the other great thing is that there's just tons of outlets and USB ports all around. You got one there. There's a port outlet there, two outlets there, which are inverted, solar inverted, outlet there, and on each side here, USB and USB-C, and an outlet. And there's plenty more where that came from. You also get lighted cabinets which is a huge bonus, as well as a lighted pantry. But let's go over this one on the interior. Let's start with the dining net. It's not a legless dinette. You do get the legs, but these dinettes are awesome because you can really move it wherever you want. You put it in front of the theater seats, in front of the sofa or you can take it outside. You don't have to bring another folding white table. You can bring this one outside, which you're probably gonna spend a lot of time outside anyway. This one folds up real easy and makes a bed out of the cushions. You also get bins on each side, which you can access from there, or open that up under the seats. Oh, there's another outlet over there, I should add. Next up, the theater seats. Right in the middle, you get the two silver cup holders, which does fold up like so. And of course, they are reclining. Just pull the lever. There you go. Faces your entertainment center. And you got some storage right in the middle, too, for remotes and all that fun stuff. And again, you got your USB and USB-C right there. Across me is the entertainment center with the very large TV, which is on the swing arm. So you can't angle it how you want. You get the fire police down below. And I like that they didn't go with the full size one because you do get some tall storage down here. And you get a little bit here, which could also be used for some remotes. This is a pull-out sofa, trifold sofa, so you can also sleep two people comfortably when you pull this one out. You got this nice soft pillow design here as well. And on each side, in addition to the USB ports and the outlets, this holds up and gives you some more hidden storage. And again, get the overhead storage that is lit. Got this beautiful island right in the middle of the kitchen. No sharp edges, they are rounded corners, which is awesome. Get the deep single basin stainless steel sink. That is this nice kind of gunmetal color. And you get the sink cover. This also comes with this super innovative kind of double-sided faucet. This is gonna give you that shower spray, which is great for washing dishes, like so. But you can also turn it and you get the kind of normal style faucet right there, which is great if you're just filling something up or whatever. 
Haven't really seen that before, so pretty innovative to me. The microwave up top, three burner cooktop, and your oven. I should also add in all of these got these kind of gunmetal handles like so for the Keystone bullet, of course. Some nice drawers on the side and under the oven. You do get very spacious under sink storage. Drawer and cabinet on this side and drawer and cabinet on this side. You do get the two door Furion fridge and freezer combo. And you get a nice sized pantry with the lighting for all that dry storage for food. Got your AC up here. You can add a second AC in the bedroom. More storage here, shelf here, and more down below. It's your control panel here, awning, glide room. The great thing about it is you can see everything. So you stand here if you want to put your bed slide in and out, and you can see pretty well where it's going. Some places, some campers you can't, so this one's great for that. And your awning, you can, you can really see it go out here. And of course, you get the second awning on this slide that right here, and you can look out that window, gives you a great view. Let's head into the bathroom first. Very tall ceilings in this bathroom, which is great. Get the porcelain toilet. Storage on this side of the shower. You get the nice skylight. I really like the barrel roof design, gives you a little tall ceiling here. With the skylight. Power vent fan here, and a nice spacious medicine cabinet here. There's your sink, inverted outlet, water heater controls. And you get some pretty spacious under sink storage. Moving on to the king bedroom, the king bed slide. Some people like the queen bed, so you get some shelf space on the side. But these windows really do give you that shelf space there and there, as well as the shelves up there. The other great thing is the USB and outlets are hanging there, so you can perfectly place your phone, CPAP, any other items right there. You each get a window on the side and one in the back. And this overhead storage also lights up. You got your dresser right in front, spot for a TV up there. Three drawers and some cabinets with lots of storage space for clothes and whatnot. On this side of the bed, you also get an outlet there, and you do get some adjustable shelving here for extra space. You also get this large wardrobe closet with a really sweet backdrop here. Perfect spot to hang your shirts and a perfect height for it as well. And in here, you get the washer, dryer, prep area. If you don't want to use it for that, it just becomes more storage. Now that we've taken a look at the beautiful interior of this one, let's check it out again. I should also mention these nice fancy lights up here. But now let's take a look on the awesome exterior. Almost forgot to mention these lights are dimmable, which really sets the mood when it gets dark out. As you can see, the outside is just as breathtaking as the inside. You see the sweet colors. You get this nice baby blue combined with the black and white. Get that awesome Flying B logo up there. And just look at that front cap. You get the B logo. You get the lights here and on each of these sides. This thing just looks awesome going down the road and on the campsite. Two slides on your off-door slide, both cable slides. 
and one on this side, also a cable slide. The thing I love about the cable slides, equal points of tension on the bottom and top because of the cables. Got the LED lights under the awnings, and you do get two awnings, one here and one here. And there you have it with both awnings out. As you can see, sun's up there, giving you tons of room, tons of room for shade. Not sure that's the correct way to say that, but you get what I'm saying. For the tires, Goodyear Endurance tires. And you also get torsion axles on this. As you can see, electric stabilizer jacks. Awesome bonus. A lot less work for you. Solid step stairs by Moride. The step above stairs to be exact. You get the awesome all black G class all glass entry door. Gives you just that super slick look. You got the JBL outdoor speakers. As you can see, also comes with the Protect 220 solar package. It's going to give you 220 watts of solar on the roof and a charge controller in the pass through storage, which we'll go over. Backed for a TV mounting bracket right here for your outdoor TV in the shade with your key TV controls and your inverted solar outlet. Got the thermal package, so it's got the heated and enclosed underbelly and the 30K BTU furnace. There's a look at that underbelly. And again, the electric stabilizers by Lippert, the PSX1s. Enough for the pass through storage, tons of space. And again, you get the same pattern that you saw on the front closet. We'll come back to that on the other side. Electric tongue jack as well. You got the BAL NXG frame by Norco. One of the best frames on the market by far. Put some information in the description to see more about that. It's the other side of the pass-through storage. Prepped for an inverter and there is your charge controller and your solar disconnect. You might have been wondering why it's got that weird shape. That's because here is your convenience center, your key TV multi-source signal controller. That's where you control the stabilizer jacks, your outdoor shower, fresh connection, city connection, all your fun stuff. That's where you winterize it as well. And those are slam latch baggage doors. This one's not, but here is your extra exterior storage. Good spot for your detachable power cord and any overflow. Obviously that one's a little skinny. And that's why you get this one, which is a great addition. The endless hot water by Keystone on this on-demand water heater. Black tank, gray tank. Furnace output there. And again, just another look at this awesome Graphics, the Flying Bee, I believe that's what they call it. There you have it. Detachable power cord, which goes into your 50 amp service. Spare tire on the back, as well as a receiver, which is got a maximum load capacity of 150 pounds. You got that huge back window. You got the ladder that leads to the roof. And again, just look at those graphics. Ladder is a 250 pound capacity. Take a look up here quick. Here's your solar panel. There's your roof. And it is prepped and ready for a backup camera. And overall, Bullet just did a fantastic job on this one. Looks incredible inside and outside. Usually you only get one of those, but you get both on this one. Looks cool at the campsite and looks cool on the road. Thanks for watching everybody. Make sure to leave a like and a comment. Let me know what you think of this one, especially if you think Bullet did a great job because I really do think they did, really outdid themselves this year. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss other future videos. We'll have more Bullet videos as well. And if you wanna learn more about this unit or other units we have in stock, check out our website, premierrv.com or come check us out in person in Bluegrass, Iowa. Thanks for watching, and as always, happy camping.